Hey guys, all right, so I am going to apply a wig from Goddess Hair Company today. Um, I don't leave my wigs on for no longer than maybe two days. So I'm going to do like a quick wig application just for the day, maybe tomorrow. So I'm not gonna be using that bowl hole and super bold and all that other stuff that you use to apply your wigs. I am just going to make sure I don't have any makeup along the edges of my hair. And then I am going to use a little bit of Shine and Jam just to push my edges back a little bit. My daughter's birthday was yesterday and so we had like a small little get together with cake and things like that. But today we are going to have like our normal girl Saturday. So every other Saturday we have like a girls day and we just go out and we enjoy ourselves. We get lunch together, we go shopping and things like that. So that's pretty much what we're gonna do today. And I want to look a little cute. She always looks cute. She turned 13 yesterday. So we are going to go enjoy ourselves. Get my edge brush, make sure those edges are back there and out of the way. All right, so we got those edges out of the way. And I'm just going to open the wig. A wig cap. This is the company. It says uh, Wigs by Amber, but the name of her company is Goddess Hair Company. And I, but I think she also has wigs by Amber too, so you can check both of them out. Ooh, this is sheer sheer. Okay. You get two. Ooh, nice. Take my braids and stick those braids in like that. And like I said, I'm not going to glue down this cap because I don't keep wigs on long. Or do I? Mm, nah, I'm not because I don't keep them on long. But you could. So I'm just going to leave it like that. I don't know what I want to do. Okay, let me show you the wig. Okay, so this is the wig. Right there. So cute, look at that, yes. This is the lace. Yes, yes, yes. Let me just see what it looks like. All right, let's see. Ooh. What do I wanna do? You know what, I may be okay with just sliding the wig cap back. Hold on, let's see. Let's try it again. Let's get that wig cap slid on back. And let's try this again. So, this is a wig reconstruction unit. When I first had this wig, I had a skunk stripe and I wore it to this side. When I sent it to her, she just split it down the middle, recolored it, and added color to the ends. And I prefer it this way, actually. Look at that lace. Wow. Look at that. Oh, look at how that blends. That's a good lace. I'm going to bring it down just a little bit. And I don't need any kind of gel or anything. That is super cute. I like that. Yes, this is really, really nice. And this is human hair. Very nice. Ooh, I could wear it behind my ears too. Like that and not even have to straighten it. Mm. Yes, yes, I love it. This is so nice. 
But if you wanted to, you could spray this spray right there on the front just to keep it from sliding back. But I don't think that's necessary in this case. This is so cute. I love it. Very nice. Okay, so again, if you have a wig that you want reconstructed, or if you just want to buy a new wig, reasonable prices, I promise you the prices are reasonable. I actually think she is having a $200 bob wig sale, if I'm not mistaken. Check her out if you want a bob wig. I do have another uh, wig reconstruction right here. This is one that I got done last year and you may have seen pictures of me wearing this one. So, and she cut it more into a bob bob because I think the last time I had it, it was like an asymmetrical bob. So this is just a 360 bob. So that one is nice too. And this is blonde and look at that lace. See? Nice. Nice, 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 nice. But anyway, so again, uh, Goddess Hair Company or Wigs by Amber. Check her out and get you a unit that will last you a long time, okay? All right, thanks for watching. Bye.